welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video in the 30 videos in 30 days challenge i'm probably just going to take you around with me today because i am going to go and have lunch with a friend and then i have to work this afternoon so i think it'll be a vlog day and today i'm going to try out the beer setting lotion and let you guys know what i think about the results of that i'm loving this authentic methods trial it's fun <laughs> And cheap. It's nice to be able to just like go out and buy the stuff and not be like, can I really afford this? The answer to that is generally no, because beauty products are expensive. So I'm about to have some brekkie. I'm going to make myself a smoothie and down a massive bottle of water. And then I'm going to take my vitamins and ease into this day. Because I worked all day yesterday with children and I am so tired. Just making the usual. Okay, today I'm filling the PB2 powder. Oh yeah. And a decent scoop for dad. And I need some cinnamon in my life. Oh yeah. So I'm having the leftover salad, pasta salad from last night with too much mayonnaise on it. And my peanut butter banana smoothie for breakfast. Helpful, y'all. And I'm going to watch a little bit of YouTube and answer some questions. If I can get my computer to turn on. Yay! We have lift off. I just discovered my new favorite salad dressing, which was pretty much just by accident. So Val had already put nutritional yeast on the salad and then I added my eggy vegan mayonnaise and fresh lime juice, like half a lime and salt and pepper and Oh my god, it was so good. I know this is already like a thing, but I've never tried to make it before. I know you can get it like Mexican restaurants, like a ma lime mayo kind of combination, but usually it has like chipotle in it. But yeah, it was, it was delicious. I'm definitely making that again. smell a lot like beer obviously. I read that this smell is going to disappear as it dries and I really hope so otherwise I'm just going to smell like an alcohol. It's interesting I smell very beery. <laughs> so because I'm doing a hot roller set I'm going to let this dry a little bit and <laughs> it's so weird I smell like bread and I'm going to do some yoga. <laughs> this is potentially the ugliest set I've ever done in my life. <laughs> I'm in such a hurry because I've got to go soon and I've procrastinated all morning because I'm tired. And I want to see my friend, but I don't want to leave the house. You know, like the gap between being somewhere and enjoying yourself and having to actually just like exit your home. Why is that so hard? Hmm? It's good. I read that the sugar in the beer works kind of like sugar water, so... But the curl looks good. My hair is super soft, but it's very curly. So far, so good. Ooh. And I definitely still smell like beer. Ooh, look. It's pretty nice. My hair is so soft. Like, so, so soft. The rumor that it works as a conditioner, I would say, is very true. I think it works better for like natural 40s kind of day wear curls. Just like running my fingers through and letting it bounce back a bit. But look at that volume, guys. So, apart from the smell, which potentially may go, I mean, it's not too strong. I might just spray some perfume on my hair. But uh, I would say that beer is also a winner. Fluff in my hair. Is it dandruff? No, it's fluff. Okay. In terms of it being like a conditioner, uh, yeah. I like it a lot. So, that is, I'll turn this way so you can see it better, but that 
is basically what it's come out like just with a bit of a brush and running my fingers through it. I don't really know what it looks like at the back, I'm sure you guys can see. But yeah, I think it's cool. It's very natural. Oh, so soft. I've said that like five times, but like it's really nice. But it doesn't have, I would say it probably doesn't have the hairspray effect of the sugar water. Like I feel like it might it might not hold in the elements very well, but we'll see. I'll wear my hair out like this today. There's a test run and we'll see how it goes. I've been stood up 15 minutes before I arrived, so I don't think it was a dick move. It was just disappointing because I've come all the way here. It took me like 40 minutes to get here, but that's okay. guys but my phone decided to shut down while I was walking through beautiful Montmartre and now it's working again and managed to turn on and says it has 31% battery now that I'm in Saint-Lazare and I'm going back to Courbevoie which you've all seen like a thousand times so sorry about that the train leaves at 144 and they declared the platform out of 21 platforms at 144 I just saw that Alien Covenant is out or I saw a poster advertising it so it's out now or soon or something and I got so excited <laughs> I know it's a bit of a controversial film, but I really loved Prometheus. I find like the whole idea behind whether or not we're a created species or the existence of aliens, all that really fascinating. Surprise! Yes, conspiracy theorist and alien believer. Or maybe we're a virtual reality. I like that theory as well. But <laughs> my point is it's coming out soon. Totally going to go and watch it. I can't wait. And yeah. I'd love to hear what you guys think. Did you like Prometheus? Are you looking forward to the new film? Do you believe in aliens? Thoughts after having my hair in the beer setting lotion for quite a while now. I've been out in the elements. It was quite windy today in Paris. It did rain a little bit. My hair is still curly and wavy. I haven't brushed it again, so I'm going to run a brush through it. But I'd have to say I'm really surprised because my hair feels very soft. It feels like I conditioned it. It doesn't feel like it has a setting lotion in it. it. doesn't feel like it has hairspray in it like the sugar water did. But actually, it has held the curl incredibly well. It's very different to the sugar water in the sense that the sugar water is a much sleeker look and gives you a lot of hold. So you can get more of like a sleek, old Hollywood kind of look with it, which is my kind of preference. Um, but this gives like a... Um, a kind of youthful 40s look like if you think of the early pictures of Marilyn Monroe when she was Norma Jean you look at early pictures of Rita Hayworth that kind of curly 40s longer hair look that just kind of looks like they naturally woke up like that you can get that kind of 40s hair with the beer literally spray it through do your hot roller set or your pin curl or your sponge roller set whatever you're using and then give it a good brush out and just kind of scrunch your fingers through like I did if you've got similar hair to me I mean I don't know how this is going to work on other types of hair but if you've got Wavy to slightly curly hair, lots of it with thin strands. This is the kind of result that you'll get, hopefully. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm very impressed. And I have to say, I think it's very nourishing for my hair. Like my hair seems to feel very good as a result of having the beer rinse. I'm going to give it another brush and show you guys what it looks like. I've already brushed it through twice today. And usually for me, if I do a set with a setting lotion or a hairspray and then brush my hair, spray it, and then try and brush it again later, it pulls my set out. My hair doesn't deal well with like restyling in the next couple of days worth of style like some people's does. But as I say, I've already brushed through a couple of times today and my hair has held the curl really, really well. Yeah, it's, it's pretty good. It's just a different type of setting lotion to the sugar water. So I think they can be used for very different purposes. So you can see it's not ringlets anymore, it's kind of waves, but it's still, you know, it's still pretty nice set. And you can see underneath I have some ringlets. I feel like, I feel like using this has renewed my hair to what it used to be like. Like I used to have quite curly hair that would turn into ringlets. And through years of using particularly hot rollers and hairspray, 
my hair is straightened out a lot like I think probably through damage because it's so fine I've kind of damaged the natural curl and this seems to have kind of returned it to its natural state even though obviously I did curl it this morning but it held the curl so well and it's not a very strong hold that I think a lot of it is like that the beer has like got into the into the shaft of hair and given it some moisture and allowed it to go with the curl if that makes sense so I'm not sure how it will go if you don't have naturally wavy or curly hair I think if you had wavy hair it would encourage it to curl more and I think if you have straight hair you might not have so much luck with continually brushing it out maybe your set will hold well initially and then you need to just like leave it I don't know I'd be really interested to hear if you guys give this a go and then like report back on how it works for your hair it would be really cool I'd love to hear that people often ask me how it's gonna work on other types of hair and you're like I'm not a hairdresser so I can like I can only guess or if I've got friends who have your type of hair I might be able to help you if they've told me um, or I've done hairstyles and other people but, you know, I don't have heaps of experience at that, so I can only answer your questions to a point. Still, still pretty happy with it, guys. I don't think it would last till tomorrow, or it might if I kind of want to wear my hair natural and not vintage, but I'm pretty, I'm pretty pleased with the results. Okay, guys, I might end it here because I have to go to work and I don't have a lot of other interesting stuff to do today. And I don't know that my dinner is going to be that fascinating. So it probably won't be like a what I ate in the day video slash beer setting lotion video, but, um... I hope it was interesting for you. I hope it was helpful. Let me know how you go if you try this out. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and check in with me again for the rest of my videos in the 30 videos in 30 days challenge slash Vader. See you on my next video, guys. Bye.